All right, y'all, welcome to another episode of Outdoor Addicts. Today's the day we finally figure it out. Yep, we got the infamous beast broadheads everybody's been talking about. Do a little testing on them. Yeah. What do you think? So these, I mean, they don't even need an introduction, no, I'm sure. No, they don't. Y'all already know the deal. We're going to do a little unboxing and a test on this here ballistics gel. We're going to yeah. see if uh, they're patented... B A technology is what they oh, say. Yeah. Bone aborting. We'll see. Let's let's give it open. Yep. What do you think? Oh, they give you a little finger thing on there. You hadn't even looked at them yet. No, I didn't want to. I wanted to. I have know. One. Let's see this one. God, leave these things. They're definitely sharp. sharp. Holy crap! Hmm. Well, that's probably the sharpest broadhead I've ever held. If you yeah. do not be careful, you are going to lay your tail wide oh, open yeah. with this thing. For sure. Dude, it's really, it's kind of hard to uh, close. Yeah. It feels a little crusty. I guess these are the little finger things that somebody's talking How about. How they give you gloves on? Yeah. Um, I guess you made them for this. I, now I know why. Yeah, that's pretty crazy, man. What do you? What's your initial impression? What do you think? Um, initial impressions, very sharp. A little crusty. A little crusty. Yeah, they don't feel very smooth, do they? I can't get these things on my hands. I guess I got big hands. Oh yeah. So. Big hands. Oh my! I can't get it to close. This one's a little bit more. This one's a little springy. I don't know. This and there it goes. See if you can get this one close. I definitely can't do it with my fingers without cutting them. That's the profile of it. It feels a little. See, I got that one to close, but this one is like, golly. Yeah, that's what I. Yeah, you definitely have to have Ow! something to close them with. Yeah, that is like. <laughs> you got yourself. There it goes. Shoot. They spring open. Well, they're fast springing they're fast open. Springing open yeah. There we go. They seem like they're getting a little bit better. Yeah. As you sit there and work with it. Yeah. Well, but there's always one stick, and they need like some oil on them or something. Yeah, we we'll have to WD-40 these things a little bit. Nah, it's getting a little better as we go. I know that some gun right there is sharp. Maybe we'll close that again. Let me put one on there. Yeah, put put two. Let's do let's do it twice. What do you think? Yeah. We got a bunch of tests lined up for these. We're gonna be making some separate videos. This video will just be the initial impressions and the ballistics gel test. I thought I just kept my thumb. That is the sharpest broadhead yeah, I sharpest think I've ever held. I ain't even gonna like, lie to you. It literally feels like a razor blade. It's yes. Probably sharper. Yes, that like, is insane. very sharp. So kudos for the sharpness for sure. I think these were sharpness is ten out of ten. Sixty-five, almost seventy bucks. One, uh, it was more than seventy with shipping. One I'm pretty sure. Though. I do have one dig on them. What's that? They only come with two. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Kind of seventy dollars or whatever, because it's. I think it's sixty-five bucks or something, but that's not including shipping. Which and I, guess, I mean, you're gonna have to have shipping unless you're gonna drive to California, which is yeah. where they shipped out of. I guess being the new. There's skin on that one. I'm like you twisting I, it on there. Yeah, I thought I'd wave my finger open. Well, let's. Yeah. You let's, think it'll open in ballistics, Joe? I think it'll open. Um, I'm curious to see. I almost feel like they're gonna stay open because they're so. Yeah. Like, what, like it feels like they got burrs on them. Like it's not like you would expect a real smooth, you know, uh, yeah. springy action, and it's like it. Yeah, it's very. Goes easy. in and catches. It's yeah. kind of like like that. Mm -hmm. I think that's going to help it out. Yeah. I don't think it was designed to help it out, but I think it will. I kind of feel like they're going to stay open. Yeah, I think it'll stay open in this. One one test that I want to do is actually put, like, a piece of leather on top of it. Simulate uh, the skin, you know? I wish we had that some way, leather. We might come up with something. Um, yeah, if they if they do well on this. See, you know, like the your skin entry open, hole, yeah. yeah cause, I almost want to put a piece of, like, some kind of bone or something that would simulate bone. And yeah. Because that would make it close. Well, so our next yeah. test, if they pass it's this, we'll do the leather and a wishbone or a, a you know, scap a scapulars. Uh, we'll put some we'll kind of bone in here and try and get it to catch. Yeah. Um, 
We'll so let's it, we'll put a chicken inside of there. Yeah, we'll we'll just shoot one of these chickens. And, <laughs> so yeah, I guess let's go ahead and get it set yeah, up. Let's do it. Knock one up. Let's try. It. All right, guys. Hang on, hang on, hang on. All right. Here we go. We got the Matthews Phase Four, seventy pounds. Shooting a 440 grain arrow with the beast broadheads on the end. Into the ballistics gel, test number one. It buried the arrow. <laughs> you want to do two? Sure. I don't know if it was completely open. We'll, we'll see. We'll have to do some measuring here. You ready? For reference, what's that bow set on? Give 70 us, us pounds. 70 pounds, 20. 70 pounds, 20, 28 and a half inch draw, Matthews phase four, at like five yards, shooting 275 feet per second with these arrows. You ready? Yep. I don't know, man. I mean, it may just be that stuff stretching. Oh. Pull one of them out and stick it, like, reverse in there. I don't want to mess the wound cavity up, though. All right, guys, we shot it. it. All right, I'm going to take the, this end off right here and just... We haven't done nothing with the arrows right now. Yeah, so. we just got done Dude, shooting it. It wasn't open. Oh, my Lord, look at that. It wasn't open. Did it, Was it open at the beginning? I'm trying to get where the camera will focus on that. I'll pull the arrow out in a second, guys, but, I mean, just for reference, you can see that unless this ballistic is, you know, like, stretches or something, we'll have to look at that slow-mo. We'll be able to tell in the slow-mo if it's That open. was not open. And that's the same way this one is. This one's even smaller. Let's look at that entry hole. That is, oh, oh, they're closed on the open. On the entry, it's closed. It's closed on the entry. This is the one. No with, way. That's the one with the oh, it twisted. That's the one with, with it on it. Oh. <laughs> so it, oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, well. Okay, pull that one out yeah. on camera. And just, I mean, for thickness, guys, the fletchings made holes in it. Look, it's cutting it now on the way out, though. That's from the fletchings. Oh, that is from, the, from fletchings. the fletchings. No, it was stuck in there. It did, it was, oh, my. It what are you? Oh, no, guys. Oh, this man, this is no bueno. Wow. Oh, no. We'll have to cut this open to look at that. Yeah. Let me cut this thing open. You can clearly see. Let me cut this thing open. Yeah, let's cut it open on camera for the haters. Let's see. That was not open. That's closed all the way down. Let me see if I can do this one handed. Oh, my goodness. I, Jacob, see if you can close this with man, your fingers. That is a so closed crazy. broadhead, man. There is no way. That that went through a Cape Buffalo. I mean, I mean, I've seen the videos of them saying, "Oh, it went through a Cape Buffalo." If it will not, I know animals aren't made of gel. Okay, because I know that's the Fletchings cut it. Yeah, but the Fletchings cut the the gel. That is literally. That is man. That's just a little guys, bit bigger. I love Bowmore. I've watched every Bowmore video there is. I really have. I was hoping this would be. This is gonna be awesome. I, I, I'm in shock. I'm a little mad. I spent like ninety dollars for two broadheads and. Golly! Should we, shoot, should we shoot a mega mate beside it and see what the mega mate does? Absolutely. Yeah. Good. Before I cut this, let's do that. Cause it may not open. Who knows? Yeah, let's try it out. Since we're here. Since we're here and queer. I mean, since we're here. <laughs> you think the mega mate? Let me set y'all up, boys and girls. I'll get you back. That's crazy. All right, boys and girls, we're back. You going to try it with the Mega Meats? Yes, sir. So we got the Mega Meat. Here, this is the same exact setup as before with the G5 Mega Meat. Now, this really wasn't part of the video, but we just, I mean, curiosity gets the best of us, so. Yeah, no, I mean, that's the thing, right? So... 
that not opening it, it kind of makes you think, well, <laughs> should we try the Mega Meats and see if they're... These branding companies are just... That's going to wound a bunch of deer, guys. Yeah. That I mean, that, there's hundreds of thousands of them broadheads sold out. And yeah. That is really going to... That is going to wound deer. I mean, the fletchings cut the gel. So say what you wish. I know. But, but maybe that maybe it's so soft it didn't get to open. That's what I'm saying. All right, I'm going to zoom up on the gel. You with Tay? Yeah. Golly, that was loud. What was oh. that? Oh, they opened. Well, one of them. Oh, it cut the target. No, it didn't. Why was that so loud? I don't know. Well, that might be a flaw right there. Look, that one was... of them opened, but the other two. Didn't. Oh my gosh! They're open on exit. Yeah, they're definitely open. On... So yeah, so. Why was that so loud? That sounded like a freaking rifle going off, didn't it? Yeah, I thought you hit the target. Me too, but look. No, I know you. Didn't. Let me grab them. I oh my lord! Some of that. All right, guys. The G5 Mega Meat. We have one blade uh, open upon entry. These other two did not. But now, on the exit, all three were open. Come on, buddy. One more than the others. So this one. I wish y'all could see a little better. I heard that. This one was open wide open. These two were not. One of them open. And it was very loud. I do not that know if that's be normal or not, but actually make them open. That was very I'll loud. Put something on top of it and see, like a piece of leather or something. Hmm. Make sure they open. All right, guys. So we're gonna cut it open. See what kind of cavities we got in here. On camera, okay, so, so no. Ain't no, ain't no fishy business going on here. Look, I mean, go. I mean, I'm not. I, I, like I said, while ago, I love Bomar. I've watched every Bomar video, bro. Like, I was, but at the same I was time, so excited about this. You can ask him. I was like, man, that I've been. We, we tried to get him the first run that he had on them, but we were too late in making our order, and they, of course, they sold out really fast. So and at like, the okay, same okay. time, though, like if this stuff is not. Yeah. Oh yeah. No. I, I mean, we're gonna be honest. There with it you. is. Yep. Y'all can see that. Where was it? That's where was the one you pulled it completely back through? Right there. Right there. That's what it's supposed to yeah, look like. That's what it's supposed to look like. Now look at this. Yeah, that's literally that's, that's open, not open. You're you're right. Yep. So I'm trying to pull on it, just kind of highlight it. But yeah, and that was with the that's a closed. Oh man, look at the difference. I know, man. That yeah. this stuff's dense, too, guys. Is it not? Like, I mean, this is this is. Some, Oh, see, and there's the Mega Man. Look, dude. <laughs> yep. It, one side open, the other two got yep. hung. I'm telling y'all guys, they got hung. Yep. On that lip, they need to be smoothed out. There's the fix. You know what you're getting with that. Yep. There's the what, open. Uh, one open backwards. Yep. I pulled this one through the right we, way. Yeah, we want to see what it looks like. That stuff is dense, man. There is no excuse. No. no. And I'm gonna tell you right now, guys. Not even for the Mega Man. If this does not go through a piece of gel, yeah. like I know we, animals aren't made of gel, yeah, but I mean, that, but. but at the same time, if it's not going to go through gel, yeah. it ain't going through a Cape Buffalo Man. open like that. Because I mean, they're they're collapsing on gel. It was closed through gel. I've never I shot mean, an animal made of gel, but uh, <laughs> it's a lot tougher than this. That's the thing, yeah. I mean, this ain't an animal, but this I mean, is look at softer, this. is it not? Look at this. I mean, that's softer than... I could put my finger through it. Man. Which might have affected the G5, but if anything, it would have helped the beast. Yeah, because that's no pressure on it going through to keep it closed. That I mean, look my, at this. That this was is kind it. of look, my thought, This too. is it. I can push this. That was that. kind of my thought, too, on the... Um, you know the the different examples and stuff was if it go if it'll stay open in this it's gonna stay open going through like organs and stuff right i mean you would think but <sighs> yeah see if you can clamp it up somewhere so we can both be a little recap on it um i'm disappointed in it um 
I was really hoping this was gonna work. <laughs> we spent What's a your lot thoughts? Of thoughts on these? I'm not using them. I'm not I hate to be like that, but I feel my honest like opinion. We're not sponsored by nobody. I'm not promoting anything, you know. Yep. I will to use some fix bikes, I guess. Good Lord, man. I fixed can, I can push that through. Yeah, I mean, the gel. But at 300 or 275 feet per second, it doesn't matter if these things open at 940 feet per second. If they don't stay open because of the force. That's what I was thinking about, too, when he was showing that video of him pushing it through with his hand. Yeah. Well, that's at your hand. slow pushing through, yeah, it's, it's open. open. Yeah. Of course. So you push through some fruit. Yeah. But in real life scenarios, two for two yeah. through the jail, not two for two or one out of two or not, not one yeah, out of two so. or a hundred percent of the time. The only thing guaranteed is that they will not be open inside of the animal. Yeah. They didn't even open on entry. Definitely not in this stuff. On our entry, which y'all can see in the video. Yeah. God, this stuff is dense. Yeah. You can see that this is the fletchings cut it. Yeah. The fl that, but there's yeah, that no the fletchings, literally. There's no open. This is there's a whole fletching from the fletchings. And that you is can it. See it here too. That's what they closed. Which one of these is it closed? This one. Oh. No, no, I'm saying close that and you can show it up against it. I thought I had one that was closed. That's on the on here. Oh, yeah, we don't have one closed. And I'm not grabbing that joker to close it because it is hard to close. They are extremely hard to close. Dang it, I just wiped that goo all over me. Yeah, I mean, I'm not doing that. That's going to lay my stuff wide open. They're extremely sharp. Yeah, ain't nobody. But for one, this is ridiculous. If you're in the stand, that thing happens. They close really good. Mm -hmm. And doesn't seem like it takes much pressure to open them so i think that would have opened better on leather show it is that one still closed no i, just I was wanting to stick it up against that don't cut yourself it. yeah it's got me yeah they they're still sharp <laughs> they're sharpness still sharp is, sharpness is still 10 out of 10 i'll that <coughs> thing sharpen okay so it was this one? Yeah. No, it was this one. Was this one. It's a little bit it, bigger. It, so you could tell it was open. Yeah. But it wasn't but it was all the way open. It was, it was flexed. Instead of being like this, because look, here's closed, watch, here's open. It was like this. See, so just open it up, cutting it. Opening it up. But I'm telling you, though, yeah. that thing moving that fast. That it pushes that, it in. All that momentum and stuff behind it keeps that thing closed. Say, go, what, you, go, say what you want. Guys. Say what you want, guys, yeah. about this video. Take it how you wish. Yeah, I mean, that, hey, make your decision. Go buy 100 of them if you want to. I don't care. I like Bo more, but yeah. that's trash. But that is it's trash. I mean, that's not – that's – if if I wanted a hole like that, I'd shoot a little tooth of the arrow fixed yeah. blade or something. Yeah. I wouldn't be shooting. I mean, yeah, because literally this is – you can't tell now because I just ruined the hole, but that would be bigger. This is going to be bigger. And you know this is going to stay open. And yeah. you get three. So recap on it. What, what's your what's your final thoughts there? Recaps are I'm not using the Mega Mates or the uh, Beast. Or the Beast. And yeah. I hate that because I was, I was so after all the social media presence stuff, I was yeah. pretty much sold on the Mega Meats and them. the Beast. I mean, yeah. we bought them. We bought them. We bought them to test, but also yeah. to use. Yeah. I mean, if the if the if the test went well, they were going on our arrows and getting sent through a yeah. hundred and seventy inch deer. Yeah, hopefully. Uh, yeah, if everything works out. But yeah, that, I mean, if I shot a hundred and seventy inch once in a lifetime deer, and that's what was on my arrow, I would be very worried. Yes, absolutely. I would. And and y'all know, man. I mean, how much work goes into hundred seventy inch deer? Oh yeah. I'm not about to risk <laughs> the last the thing that's actually doing the killing. Right. And the swacker didn't open at all. No, the swacker barely And I think it's got too much force on the blade preventing it from opening. I know it's got two small blades in the back trying yeah, they to open have to it. Do a whole flip but they out. have to flip out. And they're not gonna flip out when they're you know what I mean? Yep. Yeah, man. That's why it's Swacker's test. test is always there's one thing and then open and, and then air. To open, yeah. Yeah, like plywood. Yeah. But it's never a consistent mm -hmm. medium. In a consistent medium, like an animal. Yeah. And you've had that happen on a deer. I had that happen on a deer. I I, kill, I don't want I want to give them credit where credit's due. I did kill some deer with it and it's flawless. But I did make a bad shot on one and it did not open. And the arrow went through it. So. 
Y'all take it how you wish. Yeah. I mean, thanks y'all for tuning in. And yeah. Let us know what you think. Y'all like, yeah. comment, subscribe. We got more to Appreciate come. It, guys. I don't know if we're going to do any more tests with the beast. Yeah, we, we may come up with something else. But we were going to do some bone hey, in the jail tests and stuff. Let us know if you want to see some more tests with it. We got plenty more of this jail. I'll make up another block. We can test some different stuff if y'all want to see it. Let us know, guys. Y'all let us know. Yep. Appreciate it.